good morning friends today we are going to discuss about mealy bugs and white flies it is a very big problem that we all face while gardening mealy bugs and white flies are soft sucking insects they basically suck the sap out of the plant and which in turn makes your plant very weak it stunts its growth and as we know we can see they spread very fast so we must get rid of them as soon as they are visible to us so here you can see how badly they infect the plant they completely damages the plant so we must make sure to inspect underneath all of the leaves and around the leaf joints where they might have been hidden so once you have identified the magnitude of the problem how much part of your plants have been infected and if they are not much not a big part of your plant is infected one thing you can do is to just cut off that part that has been infected so that rest of the plants can be saved the first step that i usually take is to gently blast off the pest and their eggs with a jet of water you can use this jet of water from your garden hose and simply wash off the mealy bugs that are on your plants the second thing that you can do is to make a insect killer spray i don't generally use chemicals for this so you can make a natural spray and for making a natural spray you can take 1 2 tablespoon of dish soap and we can mix 1 tablespoon of vegetable oil to it and 1 cup of water this is the ratio i'm telling you you can use more amount of it proportionately and for mild infestation this is a best remedy after this spray is prepared we have prepared this solution spray it over the infected parts spray all over here i am spraying it on my egg plants so it is one of the very good remedy to get rid of this mealy bugs and even white flies also is one of the other natural pest control that is available to us and they are generally very cheap but we must be cautious while using neem spray it may leave some residue over your use over your plant which may harm them so first we check them by applying a little amount of neem oil to some of the leaves before using them and you must follow all the instructions that has been given to us on the label of the neem oil that we bought and one of the another method is using uh, rubbing alcohol we can use 1/4 cup of rubbing alcohol and mix it with 1 cup of water and dab it with a cotton swab on the mealy bugs that are visible we can also spray this mixture over the mealy bugs on our plants and for the white flies we may use this yellow sticky trap 
है वी टेक ए येलो ब्राइट येलो पेपर और कार्डबोर्ड एंड अप्लाई अ स्टिकी मटीरियल टू इट दे आर ऑल्सो अवेलेबल रेडीमेड इन द मार्केट यू कैन बाय रेडीमेड येलो टाइप्स फ्रॉम मार्केट ऑल्सो यू कैन प्रिपेयर इट होम सो हेयर आई अप्लाइड अ स्टिकी सोल्यूशन ओवर इट एंड हैंग इट समवेयर नियर द प्लांट्स सो इंसेक्ट्स विल गेट अट्रैक्टेड टू इट एंड विल स्टिक टू दिस स्टिकी मटीरियल as you can see in this picture all kind of insects and white flies will stick to it and another thing that we often use for distracting white flies is the use of aluminum reflective mulch that we use just to make it difficult for the white flies to find the host plant and the one thing that we can use is to leave some predators like lace wings ladybird beetles spiders etc near our plants so as they are predators of these mealybugs and white flies so it is a good idea to get rid of them and we can use insect sucker vacuums also for catching the white flies so these are the few steps that we can take to get rid of white flies and mealybugs thank you for watching